A crucial rugby championship clash turned upside down by a series of unexpected events. Yes, we're talking about the recent face-off in Perth, where the Springboks and Wallabies went head-to-head -head in a match that will be remembered not just for the on-field battles, but for the drama that unfolded around it. Just when the game was heating up, something unusual happened. The Wallabies lost not one, but both of their loose head props to injury. Angus Bell and James Slipper, both vital to the team's scrum strength, were ruled out. Bell after a head injury assessment at halftime and Slipper following a head knock during the game. And here's where it gets really controversial. The match officials decided it was no longer safe to continue with contested scrums, switching to uncontested scrums for the rest of the match. This decision effectively neutralized what many consider a clear strength of the Springboks, the infamous bomb squad. In a twist that's got the rugby world talking, SA Rugby isn't just sitting back. They've made a formal request to World Rugby to investigate the injuries that led to these uncontested scrums, suggesting that there might be more to these injuries than meets the eye. Adding to the intrigue, Wallabies boss Joe Schmidt called it one of the most bizarre games he's ever been involved in, highlighting just how unusual this situation was. SA Rugby's move has stirred up a storm. They're asking for a deep dive into whether these injuries were legitimate, prompting World Rugby to potentially review medical records and more. It's a bold move, implying that perhaps, just perhaps, there was a strategy at play to sway the match's dynamics. So, what do you think? Was this just an unfortunate series of injuries for Australia, or is there merit to the claims of tactical manipulation? Could this be a game-changing moment in how injuries are handled in international rugby? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. We want to hear your take on this fiery debate, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button to stay updated as this story unfolds. This is more than just a game. It's a drama that could redefine the rules of rugby engagement. Thanks for tuning in and until next time, keep the passion alive with Green and Gold Army News.